Give it up for your next comedian. He's a very funny man. You've seen him at the Comedy Store and Roast Battle. Give it up for Tom Whalen. <laughs> I literally have never been so glad to be in Koreatown in my whole life. Uh, it's just nice to get a... I'm actually, I don't know if you know this, Ryan, but I'm developing a video game uh, called Koreatown the Video Game. We love K-Town, right? Yeah, well, so this video game is Koreatown the Video Game, and it's when you parallel park for five hours while a homeless guy takes a shit on the sidewalk. <laughs> it's next gen, guys. This is fun. Why does it feel like you guys came here on a shuttle from the Mondrian Hotel? <laughs> like, where am I? Am I at the fucking, am I at the rooftop pool at the Roosevelt Hotel right now? Listen, Tilda Swinson, we're trying to have a good show here. No, very I love how people think they can come to a comedy show to talk. What? I don't know what you guys are around here. You guys look like you're on break from MMD right now. Like, what the fuck? This is not Mad Men, guys. Get back to work. I guarantee at least 75% of them can do a kickflip. I would guarantee that. It's good to be out, guys. It feels good. It feels no. Please come in, guys. No, please, absolutely. Do you guys want to give a shout out to your coke dealer? Don't worry, guys. I hate me too. It's okay. It's been a rough year. You know, it's been a rough year when your Spotify year in review, your number one song is the unemployment hold music. <laughs> Bro, I know that shit. I could, you hand me any instrument, I can play that right now. <laughs> this is good, guys. I love you guys. I really do. Give yourselves a round of applause for coming out. Seriously. Right. We have some non-denominational Asians in the corner enjoying. This is the least amount of Asians I've ever seen in Koreatown. <laughs> What is going on? Where are we? Don't gentrify Koreatown, okay? We need Koreatown to stay disgusting. Thank you, Dan. Thank you, Dan. Yeah, yeah, little more. Oh, man, this is good. Fucking everybody's annoying. Republicans and Democrats, you're all annoying. I'm sorry you suck. You know what I mean? Like, if I, I think it's funny how Republicans, like, uh, you know, hate participation trophies, but they also worship Confederate statues. Like, par like Confederate statues are the original participation trophies. They were like, listen, Ian, Daryl does not work for you anymore. But we will put a statue of Robert E. Lee in the center of your town. And he said, that's fine, and he fucked his cousin. I, is that true? I don't know. I think it's funny how anti-maskers are also the people that should be covering their face the most. Why are anti-maskers the ugliest people on earth? It's like, shouldn't they take this? This is like a nice, you know, they don't usually get a chance to hide their face. <laughs> Listen, guys. Hey, guys, if you shut up, I'll give you guys a bump of coke. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> See, I'll, it just got quiet. It just got quiet. Yeah, those are so hard. De Democrat. All right, so how many Democrats are in here? Most of them, right? Most of you guys? Give a round of applause. Democrats? Yeah, Liberals? Yeah. Can you just stop? Did you not get enough attention today? I'm sorry, but like, listen, this is, I, I get it. You spent all day in a thrift store. I did too. I understand. I understand. And I get it, you're a lesbian, but I would still sleep with you because most of the women I sleep with are lesbians. So. What can I say? I look like a softball coach, so. I've had at least three women call me mommy in bed, and that is. That 
unaccomplished. I think it daddy too a lot. You know, it's fucked up. Every girl I've ever slept with for like the last eight years has called me daddy in bed. Didn't get a single Father's Day card. <laughs> Disgusting. No, there's no appreciation in this world. I'm literally torn up about the Armenian genocide right now. Literally torn up. And I think it's funny, what's the, okay, so, what's the number one thing that people say is, uh, you know, the worst part about Armenians? Anybody? There's a lot. That, but like, a lot of people say uh, Armenians wear too much cologne. Did you say that? You said it, right? But do you know what the only thing worse than an Armenian that wears too much cologne? An Armenian that wears no cologne. I lived in Glendale, I know these things, okay? I live in, I don't live in Glendale anymore, I live in Silver Lake now, it's fun in Silver Lake. Anybody Silver Lake here? It's, it's fun, but like, I just don't fit in in Silver Lake. Like, everybody in Silver Lake looks like they vape cum. No one? Is that even me? Does anybody here feel, does, does anybody else have Facebook make them feel like they wish they got molested? Every day I go onto uh, Facebook and they say like, you know, sign up for the Boy Scouts Victims Fund, up to $200,000 in payout. If I had known it would pay, I would have been a much sluttier little boy. I would have been, oh, I would have been just kissing at baseball coaches and flaunting that ass. Instead, I was like the fat kid that always had floppy socks and ice cream on his face, going around to his neighbors asking them for glasses of water. Are you a confirmed alien? I'm sorry, you. I get it, though, I get it. Tilda Swinson, I feel like Tilda Swinson, and you look so much like her. You can have a career. I don't know if you're trying to be helpful or you just, your dad didn't like love you enough. No, you're great. I'm being a, God, I'm an asshole. I'm an asshole. This fucking sucks. Light her up, dude. Light, light her speaking of lighting her up, who wants to smoke weed with me after this? I don't have any weed. You guys definitely have weed, bro. Without a doubt. God, am, do I look like I would fucking lost my virginity in a Supreme right now? This is, not, this is not how I actually look. These are my friends. I'm not that funny. I'm not very funny. No, this is great, guys. I love you guys. This is fucking so much fun. Give yourselves a round of applause. I wasn't supposed to be on tonight. I'm going to give time back to the room. I love you guys. I'm tired.